This is an ultrasound study regarding a calculus. This is the dense coarse ecogenic area entering from the low pole into the groin of the pelvis. It measures approximately 22, 24 millimeter by 8 or approximately 8 or 7.4 millimeter. This is the upper pole of the kidney, lower pole of the kidney, mid region. These uh, these are the, this is the capsule of the kidney and the tiny cystic areas that you are seeing. These one, this, 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 this is the, these are the pyramids and this is the cortex above the cystic areas, which are the pyramid, medullary pyramid or the medulla. This and then the portion of the renal parenchyma that is anterior to the cystic areas is the, is the cortex. Its equogenicity is normal, corticomedullary differentiation is intact. There is minimal hydronephrosis. So you see few, though these white areas are those of uh, central sinus complex, fat, and minimal hydronephrosis with the calculus, and this is the longitudinal section of the kidney. Kidney is normal in size, measures 10.7 centimeters in length and 4.9 centimeters in anterior posterior diameter. So it will be easy for you to follow me. This was the view that we were focusing on. The longitudinal section, kidney moving, gliding over the source muscle. Now the transfer section. There we are. transfer section in which you can see the calculus and the sharp shadow posterior to it and this is the true uh, transfer section with right renal vein and in the kidney but we get the uh, calculus here in transfer section It's very dense, coarse, ecogenic means that the, the sharpness of the shadow is indicative of how much justified this area is. So from transverse to longitudinal now, here you can see that the, it's entering the pelvis, pelvic region from the lower pole. Otherwise, the kidney function is normal. This is the longitudinal section again. This is the longitudinal. Uh, this is the, uh, the section. So this is uh, the study of renal calculus.